Now let me just eat all the food to recover all the damage that I ultimately took from my cooking exploration here. Welcome back to Worlds Collide, a absolutely wonderful Minecraft adventure map. Absolute pleasure to be playing this. I would uh, really like to thank everybody for their support so far on this series. I have not had this kind of outpouring of love for a series in a while, and I want everybody to know that it is appreciated. Uh, last episode, we murdered a cult. This episode, I don't really have a particular destination in mind. I, I figure we'll wander around. Uh, I was told that the one of the map creators reached back out, or reached out to me, not back out, that would imply that they've already reached out, uh, reached out and said that the, I might like the nether area. What is this? Oh, it's a boat propeller. Ah, that's clever. And I think I spotted another area up there. I was actually aiming towards a cave I thought I saw over here. But the nether area... Ah, there it is. That's what I was aiming for. This is most certainly a trap if I've ever seen one. Wander on in. Hello, can we conduct a business? Interesting. There is a business to be conducted. I do not wish to conduct the business with him, but there is business to be conducted with the Hermit. Yes, but I thought I spotted a... a... another area up here, another portal or something. I spotted something on fire. Chances are, if it's on fire, it's nether. That's just the way these things work. <laughs> that reminds me of Spongebob. Liar, liar, pants on, plants for hire. I don't know why this reminds me of that. Whoa. Maybe not the nether area I was looking for? But intrigued nonetheless. I kind of want to explore around a little bit this episode, you know? I I don't want to rush this map. I want to, I want to enjoy this map. And actually, my compass is taking me away from that scary structure, so... I'm heading towards the scary structure. Oh, it's a little... Oh, that's cute. A little frozen water source there. Very nice. Very well done. God, I, I can't help but keep saying this, but this map is absolutely gorgeous. I am just in awe of this map. I am so impressed with it. And uh, I, I do know that I am missing things in this map. Uh, I will never be able to uncover every secret. Uh, dear God, I am... I enjoy playing Minecraft as, as much as the next person, but I am not that much of a hardcore player. What is this area? What are you? What is it? Okay, there's zombies and shit over there, so I probably don't want to go there. Although all those water streams lead back to a, a big old lake. Probably makes some amount of sense to just kind of swim up this water source as high as I can go. I want to get to the top of that thing. I want to get to the bottom of this by going up top. Because that makes sense. Oh man, this is going to be a hike. Block by block. So I've been playing a... I've been playing another couple of games. Uh, I don't know if anybody remembers LEGO Rock Raiders. I, I did a series on uh, a fan remake. Uh, LEGO... Uh, Manic Miners is what it's called. It's basically a Unreal Engine remake of, of LEGO Rock Raiders. Ooh, I made that jump. I can't believe I made that jump. Outstanding. And I failed to make that jump. Come on. Aha! Ooh. What is this thing? It's just something that's on fire, I guess. 
Well, that's not very adventurous. Hmm. Why is it here, and why is it on fire? That's a giant sword over there. Now that's interesting. Can I... No, I can't put out the flames. Hmm. No, this is probably something that I'm gonna I'm gonna end up coming back to later. Oh, uh, I won't worry about it too much. What I do need to worry about though is that's a giant sword. Or I think that is supposed to be a giant sword. There's a lot of shit in the woods now. All right, I'm gonna deal with this the only way I know how. Screaming and running in the opposite direction. Yeah, look at that. This is just like a giant sword. <gasps> Light. Which means... Probably shelter. Come on, go, 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 go. Run faster, run faster, run faster. Must go faster, must go faster. Hellos. I can't sleep. There's monsters nearby. Oop. Let me sleep. Thank you. Oh, there's a zombie coming. Oh, did you see him? Okay. I'm taking your potatoes. All of your potatoes is belong to us. All of your potatoes is belong to us. Outstanding. They've... I, I, I want to know. How many hours did it take to make this map? Even the trees are, like, customized. And that's just ridiculous to me. There is so much care put into this map. It's... It's actually nuts. More civilization. Raw rabbit. Raw chicken. Can I cook this? Are you able to, like, cook on this? Oh, you are. Interesting, I've never actually used this mechanic before. Again, I do a lot of, uh... Well, as I've, I've said before, I don't do much survival. I usually resign myself to... Uh... To ad custom adventure maps. That's always been my bread and butter on this, on this channel. This is taking too long, and now I'm bored. But I, I want my rabbit. Oh! Yeah! Look at that, I'm a chef after all! Let me cook this last rabbit here. That's nice. I like that mechanic. That's neat. Now let me just eat all the food to recover all the damage that I ultimately took from my cooking exploration here. Come on. Hassenpfeffer. I think that's a uh, peppered rabbit. I think it's a, I think it's a German thing. I used to own, like, pet rabbits. I would show them at the local county fair. I could... I could never... I cannot bring myself at this point to eat rabbits. Like, after raising them... For... After after having rabbits as pets... Oh, the... The compass is pointing me back that way. You know what? I've already given up on the fact that I'm going to be doing... The dungeon. I just want to walk around. Whoa. Whoa, what's that in the distance? Wow. I don't know what that is. I don't know if I want to know what it is. Dear God, this map is just massive. Excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me. I'm here to find hidden loot. Wheat. I don't really need wheat. But I probably should have figured that that would be wheat in here. Oh, those are airships over there! What? What is this place? I'm, I'm super intrigued now. Whoa.
Oh. It's a whole ab abandoned city. No, it's not abandoned. There's clearly people here. And there's... I think those are nether mites? Pit! It's a... Pit dwellers. Interesting. They trade garbage. Ow. Incredible. Like, this whole map is just nuts. I wonder if I'm going to have to come here for a quest. A whole bunch of stuff over there. I'm going to go around and see what there is to see over here. Maybe I'll find some sort of epic quest or some mighty loot. Ooh, merchants, never mind. I found the, where the epic, where they keep the epic loot. The thirsty pig. Oh. Oh. Big O. Well, well, well. So that's where the legendary blacksmith is. Good sir, I will be coming back for you a little later. I want to get to the other side of the pit here. I... I feel like I've accomplished nothing this episode, but I've seen so many really just neat things. And I'm robbing this the local community blind, evidently. Am I the hero or the villain in this story? I don't feel much like a hero. Ooh. More loot. This is just such a pretty area. area. Very scary sword. You know what I should do? I need to... I need to go back to the big castle. Um, apparently... Interesting that there's armor here. Golden boots. Protection. I'm gonna drop a couple things off here. So when I was doing my escapades, wandering around the the village, or wandering around the castle, redstone, that's bread, there's apparently a pit merchant. There's apparently a really, a shield. There's a, is that one of the nether areas? There's apparently a netherite sword in the big castle, so we're gonna have to go back there at some point and claim the netherite sword. Wait a second. Well, not only is there a wither here for some reason. Oh, I get it, so there's multiple parkour areas. Get out of here. There's multiple parkour areas within the This isn't going to end well. Damn it. Oh, it spawned me all the way back here. Damn it. Oh, I thought I had that jump. Okay. Well, the entrance to the next dungeon is supposedly around here. Yeah, we're definitely going to be going into the nether areas. I, I need to redeem myself. That was a really poor showing as far as parkour go as far as parkour goes. And so far, the map seems to be taking me the the dungeons seem to be hmm? I'm on top of the next dungeon? I don't get it. Unless no, I, I actually don't get it. 
Why am I to the... Unless there's a secret entrance to the dungeon. Within this lake is the next dungeon. How do I get there? this lake is the dungeon. Or at least, the lake is above the dungeon. Oh, I... Oh. What's that? Hello. Hang on, I'm gonna... I don't know if it's just faster to do this from... There we go. Is that... What is that? Is that the... Wait, the scary sword thing that I passed earlier. Is that part of the dungeon? Honestly, I... So, kind of getting back here. I'm super excited to start exploring. I'm going to explore some of these civilizations, like, a little harder. Like, all these big... Uh, these larger areas. Um, much more in-depth. Like, that is something that I plan on doing. I, I would like to get back to the castle, because there is apparently a really good sword over there. This is the- this is like a skull. And that is apparently a fox. Is the skull significant? This is a man's ribcage. Oh, what's this? Is this the entrance to the dungeon? No. But this is awfully suspicious. Am I just... Am I dead? Am... I think I'm dead. Um... What? Wait, what the hell just happened? One, two... Wait, why are these lights counting down? Wait a second. The... I needed the helmet. I'm in the dungeon! Okay, it's, it makes so much sense now. So I needed to go into the dead body with this helmet to be able to survive long enough to make it through that drowning puzzle. Okay, I need to, I need to rest here and like recollect my thoughts on what the hell just happened. That is such a good mechanic to make sure that you can't get into the next dungeon too early or too late. It's a water maze! It's it's a water maze! So I'm pretty sure that that... There's, I saw the three water holes. If I'm going by based off the compass, which is pointing me this way... Pretty sure this is the water hole I need to take. But I kind of want to explore... Unless this one wraps around. Yeah, I think this one wraps around a little bit. This is a, just generally impressive. There's got to be something here. They wouldn't have a dead end with no chest or anything in here, would they? But apparently, I need to leave. The locals don't much care for my, my brand of shenanigans. Hmm. 
Well, all right. Can I cook the fish on here? No, I can't. Bummer. Incredible. This is... I love how that was all practically done. Like, there was no command blocks. It was all done entirely practically. That was such a good mechanic. All right. I think I'm going to wrap the episode up here. Um, I guess I don't have a choice. Next episode, we are doing the dungeon. We are here. We are stuck. We're completing this thing. Uh, thank you all very much for watching, and thank you all for the support. And we will see you all in the next episode.